it looks like Peak Design secretly updated the V3 plate without changing anything on the packaging or in the description. I just noticed that the latest order I got for the standard plate V3 from Peak Design is different than all the previous ones I have. And I pretty much exclusively use this plate on every camera or accessory I got. One of the reasons is that I actually have a fairly large collection of Peak Design bags. And I wish I could say that these are all of them. And every single one has a Capture Clip V3 on it. And also I use Arca style tripods and sliders everywhere. So let me show you guys what the old plate looks like and what the new plate looks like. This camera has one of the original V3 plates on it. As you can see, the screw is not flush and it has almost two layers of metal. And here is the new version that I just got not too long ago. As you can see, the screw here is flush with the metal and there's no two steps. It looks like it's just the grooves and the one step flat metal piece. The overall plate itself is exactly the same as the old one. There's no difference whatsoever except the, this hole where you can hook up your Peak Design wrist straps is a little bit smaller. It feels like it's a little bit smaller, although I haven't actually tried attaching one of these to it. But let's go back to the basics here. These plates are Arca style plates and they are squares. So you can mount the camera in 90 degree variations, which is awesome. I use this plate for everything and not just cameras, my tablet holder, my phone holder, also everything else that I have, like my Adalcrone sliders, they have these plates on the top because it's just easier for me to grab the camera off the tripod, drop it on my slider and do the slider shot if I need to, instead of having to take them all off and, and, and unscrew them, screw them up, or even larger tripods like that one back there, that's a Sirui VHX10 head. I exclusively use these Pro Media Gear PM501s, which are actually 501 compatible plates. So they are good for like Manfrotto, Sirui, and Benro heads. But it is a Arca Swiss top in one single plate. So that way I don't have to build something like this where I have to attach a clamp on top of something else like the original plate that came with the tripod. I can just slide this in and straight go into the plate from Peak Design. This also helps a lot if you want to stabilize a larger camera and stand it down someplace flat. This way it's not going to tilt left or right or front, even if you put a heavy lens on it like this one. The standard plates also work with locking tripod heads. For example, I have this Sirui head right here and it does have this pin. So in order for you to put the, the, the capture clip in there, you got to push it in and you slide it in and lock it down. Now if your knob comes loose and you try to remove the body, it does not come off because the pin stops it. You have to push the pin and take it off. And this also works with the new plate that I just got the same exact way. So if you have this plate on, then it works the exact same way. It does not come off unless you push it. So this is still also really secure, just as it should be. I'm not entirely sure why they updated this plate and I don't really see anything mentions on the box. The model number is the exact same as before. Please let me know in the comments below if you had any problems with the newer plates compared to the old ones or if you have any other differences that I did not spot. I feel like they work the exact same way. I'm very happy with my Peak Design clips and, and plates and I clearly love them a lot since I have it on every single bag I got and all my gear is set up to use these specific Square Arca compatible plates because it's so easy to work in this situation where I can just grab the camera and move it over without having to adjust anything. This is it for today's quick video. If you enjoyed it, please hit the like button. And if you didn't, just watch it again at 0.75 speed. Maybe I'm speaking too fast. See you guys later.